So this is the Ultra Pulse fractional blade of CO2 with the deep FX handpiece in place. This is a fractional blade of handpiece that allows us to deliver about 0.2 millimeter spot sizes um, up to a you know significant depth, you know several hundred microns, depending on your energy settings. For this patient, she has some lines on her forehead that really concern her, as well as some lines um, periorbitally, what's commonly known as the crow's feet, and as well as some you know, enlarge pore size, some irregular pigmentation in these areas. So what we're gonna do is treat the wrinkles with the deep FX, and then do a light resurfacing of the whole area above her cheeks um, to blend everything in. The active FX handpiece has a broader spot size with each pulse, but it's more superficial. So it gives you some more superficial thermal damage instead of the burrowed thermal energy cores produced by the deep FX. What I usually do is do, do the deep FX first, get the deeper energy out of the way, and then do the more superficial pass of the active FX after that. And you can do them in the exact same session. We're using a 15 millijoule setting. This is a conservative setting. If someone came in with a lot of, you know, diffuse wrinkling, kind of saggy skin, a lot of texture regularities, we, we could push it even up to 30 millijoules. And the rate is 300 hertz. The delay is every half second it'll fire. And it's about a 10% density. So that's again, conservative. We have gone up to 20% on rare patients, but I would not go higher than that. I'm not trying to overlap at all. I'm keeping the wrinkle right in the middle of my pulse, so I get an even spread of, of the pulse around it. How are you doing? I don't anything. Good. Good answer. Okay, so we are done with the deep effects. Again, very easy, really very minimal bleeding, just rare pinpoint bleeding. So this is the active FX. Uh, we're choosing energy around 125 millijoules with a rate of 100 hertz that determines the power. So it's a conservative power of 12.5 watts uh, with a pattern three, which is a square a size six and a density of two. A density of two is probably in the 30 or 40% coverage with a single pass. And we're only doing one spot per area. We're not overlapping with this as same as the deep FX. Um, and this will give us more superficial fractional ablation. And I'll show you what this looks like. And one thing you'll notice me doing is I just slightly, you know, flick it into the hairline so that there's no line of demarcation around her scalp, which would look really strange to other people and to her and would really ruin the entire treatment because that's the one thing they would fixate on. Perfect, very nice and even. How was that overall? That was great.